and welcome back to Ganesh Institute channel. So in today's video, we are going to discuss about Adam Bashford's prediction and correction formula. Okay, so it is also a numerical analysis method where you can find out the value of y uh, if you are given with particular dy by dx. Okay, so let's get started with an example. Here, you can see that you need to find out the value of y 1.4 using the particular method when dy by dx is given to you and some of the values are also given to you okay so that means the first step is you need to make a table you can see that if x is 1 y is 1 right so you let's start with x naught so your x naught is 1 your x1 is 1.1 your x2 is 1.2 your x3 is 1.3 and you need to find out the value of y at 1.4 right now when it comes to y you can see uh, that at x is equals to 1 y is also 1 then at 1.1 if x is 1.1 y is 1.233 then at 1.2 y is 1.548 it is already given to you at x 1.3 y is 1.979 and at 1.4 you need to find out the value of y okay so now because the method is about prediction and uh, correction formula so here also you have to apply one formula which is if you need to find out the value of y prediction Let's say because you need to find out y4, so it will be y3, that means the last previous y. Then the interval, as you can see the difference between the terms here, the class size is 1.1 minus 1, that means 0.1, correct? H by 24, this is in the question, I mean the formula, then 56F3 minus 59F2 plus 37F1 minus 9 f naught this is your y prediction and when it comes to correction then the formula is once once you find out the value of y4 prediction then y4 correction will be y3 plus h by 24 this is same but now it comes f prediction 4 plus 19 f3 minus 5 f2 plus f1 this is the formula these two formulas you need to use how you will use them let's see so x0 and y0 is given so what is your fxy divided by dx is x square 1 plus y correct so that means your f1 the, these values are for naught x0 y0 so your f0 will be x0 square 1 plus y0 right so x naught is 1 y naught is also 1 so 1 square into 1 plus 1 that means 2 correct then f1 it will be x1 square 1 plus y1 so x1 is 1.1 square 1 plus y1 is 1.233 correct so when you solve this it will be 2.70193 then your f2 will be x2 square 1 plus y2 that means your x2 is 1.2 1 plus this one y2 is 1.548 when you solve this it will come out as 3.66912 then your f3 would be x3 square 1 plus y3 so that means 1.3 square 1 plus 1.979 so it will turn out to be 5.03451 then when you need to find out f4 then you will use this for f4 you firstly you need to find out y4 p correct so y4 prediction will be y3 so y3 is what 1.979 plus h is what the interval 0 0.1 by 24 56 f3 f3 is 
5.03451 minus 59F2. 59F2 is 3.06912 plus 37F1. So F1 is 2.70193 minus 9 f naught f naught is 2 right once you solve everything uh, you will get one value which is 2.5701 this will be your y4 prediction right now you have got y4 prediction then you can find out f4 prediction how so now in this case you will use x4 square 1 plus y4 prediction okay so x4 is what 1.4 1, 1 plus y4 prediction is this 2.5701942 once you will solve this you will get f4 prediction correct so that will be 6.9975 so this is your f4 prediction now you have got this if you substitute this f4 here you will get the correct value of y4 that means the value of uh, y at x is equals to 1.4 okay so what is your y3 it is 1.979 plus h is 0 0.1 by 34 9 f4 prediction is this 6.9976 let's let's take up to four decimal places plus 19 f3 is what 5.03451 minus 5 f2 is what 3.66912 plus f1 is 2.70193 once you solve this, you will get the perfect answer for Y4 correction and that is the value of Y4 correction will come out to be 2.5747993. Okay, so in this way you can use Adam Bashford's method to find out the more accurate value. Uh, more accurate than Milne's method as well so you can use this but uh, it will be given uh, in your question that which method you can choose and if it is not given then you can use either the Adam Bashworth's or Milne's method okay Milne's prediction and correction method I hope you understood this video and if so then don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel till my next video take care of yourself bye bye